I want to look at autofill options. I want to use the autofill to make similar columns here to what we have on the side here. First one, I need days. Put my mouse there in the corner and I use autofill and pull down. If I look closely here, I will notice that there are no weekends. It is only weekdays. This has weekends. I want weekdays. I click in the autofill options in the middle there and I say fill weekdays. Good. Next one over here, I need one of the month. Use autofill, pull down. Oh dear, I don't want that. Autofill options. I want fill month. That's correct. Next one. I want a series of numbers. Pull down. Oh dear. I want a series of numbers. Series. Right. Next one is months. Jan. That looks right. Well, oh, I think it's right. It stayed the same. Next one is group one, two, three. That's a word and a number. You pulled on. That looks correct. This one, oh dear, I go to the side here. That is 6, 6.15, 6.30. Right, I need to give the computer a help, a guide. I've given the first two times. Select those two times and then use autofill and pull down it's the same. It's picked up, but I've gone by 15 minutes every time. Good. Have a look at autofill functions. This is a very useful feature when you want to use autofill. And you use autofill because you're too lazy or too clever. And you don't want to spend your time typing all of these things in long lists. Use autofill to do it.